that would be. What's going on, everybody? It's Bill. We're back with Bangs here. I'm doing a little bit of uh, renovations here, like uh, overnight, and uh, we connected the drawbridges, uh, as I said it would in the last episode. But um, what I want to do is, I figured you know, make this a little bit more fancy. And I just gotta remember not to fall into a pit of spikes. And Not too hard to do, right? Meanwhile, I just fall right in. Mm-hmm. Okay. So I'm building a little, I'm building a little archway here for. I'm gonna do this as like a, just kind of a fun little project. Bangs, do you have any? Do you have any rebar frame ramps? Nope. Only got uh, squares. I, I I wound up sliding off into the spike pit, into yours. Again? <laughs> this is like the third time I did this, guys. Overnight. <laughs> and our screamer showed up. Uh, let me do let me do the good deed of uh, making sure that the that the you know, that the drawbridges are all up. Uh, to Fang's and space. Horde Nights tonight, so... Uh, oh yeah, thank you for reminding me, Fangs. Yeah, we got a Horde Night coming up, so... And so, yep. We got uh, we got some fun stuff to do. Uh, you know, Horde Night prep and all that. And we really don't have to, because I didn't look at the base. Uh-huh. I could be using a... Uh... A auger the entire time, I won't even need to worry about the zombies. Mm-hmm. We got a little bit of, uh, we got a little bit of, I got a little bit of, uh, the, um, what do you call it? The, you know, like, got a little bit of decorating to do on this, uh, on this little archway, just for, just for the sake of, uh, simplicity. Actually, you know what, I'm not gonna use the, um, I'm not gonna use rebar, I'm just gonna use wood, because I got so much iron. Wood frame ramps. And a couple cops are outside of Fangs' base, I'm just gonna let them do their thing. Are they gonna fall into my spike pit? Yes, sir. Alright, then I need to be ready to kill them so they don't go kaplooey. <laughs> Alright. Meanwhile, I'm just over here building like they're kind of like, like nothing, you know, kind of like nothing's wrong. And one of the one of the cops uh the cops spat over. Ah, I got I got stuck in one of the one of the spikes. I know not the spikes, yeah, both but both cops are in here. Uh, you know what? Let's snipe them really quick. Can't hurt. This is what you get for spitting at me, you clowns. Oh, one exploded. Both explode. Oh, well. Damn, and somehow I didn't even take a single drop of damage. None of... My blocks took barely a single drop of damage. Like, they haven't even had a total of a thousand to them in that area. Wow. Yeah, uh... My base is extremely strong. <laughs> strong. One way of thinking about it. Um, do, do, do. Gotta run around to their side, folks, and for this little, little design. So, with the, ah, oh, the, the drawbridges. <laughs> the drawbridges are not the drawbridges are not going up or down. Oh no. Glitched? Yeah, glitchy. Well that's just fun. It happens sometimes with them, they glitch out a little bit. I think they're working okay now. Alright, so what I was going to do over here is... 
this is also you know, like I'm doing this uh, design as a interesting little thing you know just to just to help keep spiders off the uh, spires off the drawbridges so going over to Fangs' base so you know kind of what does not just for not just for beauty folks but it's also for uh, for uh, practicality so um, that's done and we can get these from we can get the others from the other side oh from the drawbridges going over so um, having fun. this all upgrade to steel is now just a terrifying thing at luck. Is it just kind of like really just kind of creepy and eerie? No, it's just all the boxes from the shape that gets made to showing that it's like incredibly durable. Oh. Oh crap, I ran out of concrete. Well, thankfully we can utilize one of the uh, one of the drawbridges over to Fangs' base. Mm -hmm. See, we're already putting this to use, folks. We're, we're putting putting this all to use. While I'm here, I might as well just grab some steel and some shaving cream. So, and there, and we just need a. I just need a. Just grab 500. This is. You know, this really isn't that resource intensive. Like I say, it's just kind of like up, you know, up in the design a little bit. You know, getting it, getting it looking pretty. Do, 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 do. And I'm out of steel again. Hey. Holy crap! I've gone through nearly an entire inventory full of steel. Oh man. Oh, man. Yeah, I, I just leveled, about. I just leveled up again intense. after leveling construction tools and to 94. I'm honestly worried for our stock uh, polish or <laughs> We're gonna need more shaving cream. cream. Dude, we're out on the second and block, second storage thing. Uh, that, for sh that's for shaving, how much. Uh, for, for shaving cream or? No, for steel. <laughs> yeah, like uh, guys, uh, remember when I said a couple episodes ago that we're out of like, are we already went through, like, a box and a half? Yeah, we're basically down to one box left. Uh, I was kind of like, oh, no, it's not like you have a strong base or anything like that, but it's just kind of like, that's how much steel we've been going through. And, and I cannot imagine trying to get this in normal old yeah, could, game mode. That's the thing. It's like, this is why we did it. Oh, um, Fangs, do you want to come over and kind of look at the, the new edition? Uh, it's not finished for upgrades, but... Yeah, I just want to know what uh, what you think. I got first finish, finish what I'm doing. I mean, it'll only take you five seconds, but... Uh, it'll take me more than five seconds to come all the way up the stairs. Oh, right, you have the giant staircase, and yep, there's Fangs' Wars collection again. Uh, let's just see the progress down. Holy, that's a lot of steel. This is just terrifying. Yeah, like I said, it's uh, terrifying in quantity. I love how some of your some of your staircase hasn't even dried yet. Yeah, and it's annoying. Oops. What you do? I was upgrading some of your blocks to steel, and I accidentally upgraded one to. To stainless. Oh, that's what I'm doing. I'm just oh. doing this one at a time, getting it all upgraded to steel, then all the way up so I have more inventory room. I know I'll be stainless steel eventually, guys, but i give things a little bit of help. Because uh, I'm waiting for wait, I'm waiting for steel to well, wait for concrete to dry up above. I'm just jumping up uh, down at things. <laughs> do, 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 well, do. These stairs are gonna take forever to dry. Well then go get the go get the rotating the oscillating fan to cool the cool to help it dry. Huh? You know the rotating fan that uh, rotates on its own? Nope. You've never seen that in like a classroom? Oh, you mean that 
that little that little one that rotates back and forth. Mm. That's called oscillating. You do realize this don't stop spiders from climbing or and moving or to the left. From uh, the wall, the inner pit side. You mean like uh, out of the uh, out of the out of the pit itself? Yeah. I mean, this is just to keep it from going, uh, keep them from, uh, from, like, jumping onto the dry ridge. Alright, yeah. time to grab shaving cream. Shaving cream. Yeah, we're, you know, not only am I teaching Fangs a lesson, you know, like, a, teaching him a new word, oscillating, but, you know, if you guys didn't know, you were learning it too. <laughs> See, we're, we're even educational. Or, no, 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 let me rephrase that. Or even edumacational. Edumapathenol. <laughs> <laughs> that's what my that's what my parents would say. Like, uh, like, oh, you mean edumacational? <laughs> yeah, this is almost dry, folks. But it's just like it's kind of. I'd say it's like you know, overall, it's not a bad design. Almost kind of Japanese a little bit. In terms of how it's designed up, um, this one concrete block is uh, drying still. I mean, it hasn't been that long. It's not the, you know, typical concrete block that takes uh, 50 years to dry. But like mine, my stairs. <laughs> uh, it's been over a day and it still hasn't dried. That's why I said you need the oscillating fan down there. Help it dry. Oh, I went back into the spike pit. Yeah, you really do love that spike pit. Oh yes, I love it so much because I just want to give all my HP to it. Yes, the donation is appreciated. <laughs> <laughs> Thank goodness this is not a blood bank. Otherwise, uh, a lot of my blood would be in there. Mm-hmm. You know, actually, now that I think about it, folks, I should probably put in some ladders so while I'm thinking, you know, like, in, over in the garage pit, just so I, just so in case that happens, you know, to me, like, wouldn't be a bad idea. No, I don't need 412, uh, 412, uh, ladders. Now you know why I put ladders. Yes, and I'm going to put, uh, and put, and uh, smack the crap out of this thing with ladders. Lather it in ladders. <laughs> Lather it in ladders. <laughs> I'm gonna be right back, folks. Uh, hopefully this does. This should not take too long. Like, really, it's just placing ladders down. Well, folks, I've got the, I've got all the ladders installed for the, for, for the garage. Uh, I wound up doing a whole bunch of just. Just a bunch of wild upgrades here. Um, uh, I think I wound up doing it uneven, but on one side. Nah. We won't worry about that. Install ladders on like either side of all the drawbridges, and uh, even one in between the drawbridges going over to Fangs' area. So. Do, 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 do. Oh, I see what the I see what the what the problem is. I accidentally. So oh, it's not that big of a deal. I space the ladders out where it's um. I space the ladders out where, and I forgot that I put a space in between. Like goes over the one, like it's weird. It's it's like a, f I. It's it's kind of stupid. Um, it was like so. Really, it should be moved over like another block for some of the ladders, which I'll fix really quick, guys, on camera. You know, like you know, I'm not perfect with my with my uh, with with my measurements. So it's like you know, sometimes I forget this stuff. So, all right. So, 
Thankfully, I have not hurt myself on the spike, so we'll do in this process, but... So... For now. Yeah, for now, but... I think it's like this. So... Just space it over an extra block, and... And I've been very careful not to, uh... <laughs> Upgrade the blocks with uh, shaving cream, you know, like uh, the, you know, like what I call the floor for the steel blocks. I haven't done it yet, hence on yet, but that can still change. Alrighty, so we just gotta, I just gotta rip these out really quick. And so I just need a couple more liar blocks. And Basically, it lines up with the corners of the of the garages, really. So it's really not a hard process to fix here. So back up a little bit just so I can place the blocks. So I'll place the ladder blocks because it's weird, like uh, when you're trying to place blocks around. And that looks to be fine. And let me just pull out the frames from under. Me like uh, as I kind of get back up and um, we just gotta pull these out too and and I'll check the work. Um, what? Well, I just gotta hang on to the ladder real quick. Oh, took a little bit of damage from the from the spikes, but like I you know trying to get trying to clamp back onto the ladder, but it's really no big deal. It's like. So we'll just check the handiwork over here. It's on that corner. Ah, yeah, so, yep, everything's perfect now, folks, so... That's really nice to see, and, uh... uh not much to do before... Before Horde time, you know, like, uh, so... I'm just gonna be kind of patching in this, uh, dirt section of what used to be a gravel road, like, weeks ago, like, months ago. It's really not something to worry about, like, you know, well, it's like, I just want to do it just so zombies don't try to dig into the, um, whatever you call it, uh, try to dig into the garage pit wall and then make it into, make a fiasco. Uh, so, but, I'm gonna keep doing this stuff and, you know, like, just work on doing extra things here around and, uh, and, you know, we'll, we'll meet you at the horde time. Alrighty, folks, so it's almost a horde time. We got zombies, uh, climbing up and everything. Yeah, you know, like, well, had a screamer show up for for the fun, and, uh, seems like, uh, you know, it's, gonna be, a, it's gonna be a fun, fun horde night. You know, the screamer pit should be able to take care of itself, uh, and there's, so uh, there's horde, uh, there's horde kicking off, so, see how we do. Should repair my SMG really quick. Yep, here they come. next to nothing that can beat us. We'd have to have like a thousand cops exploding. At once. <laughs> they just turned- they just turned- even then... It just turned to a mushroom cloud. Uh, we- it'd take a tactical nuke to take out this place. <laughs> um... Well, I actually misplaced the. I did it stupid with the ladders on the garage pit. Uh, cop just took out some ladders. Great. Yeah, we'll get that repaired sometime. No, I did it to where like uh, they're able to climb out. Of the, they're they're able to climb out of the the spike pit. Oh great, they're over at the. They're actually over on the garage pit aisle. Yeah, this is gonna be a problem. Hang on. Hang on. I'm gonna... I'm gonna make sure I hold down the garage pit, so... Make sure I just bring up those... Uh, make sure I bring up these, uh... These, uh... Make sure I bring up all well, the, uh, What you could do is lower the drawbridges, except the ones at my base, but have the ones connected to my base down like they are right now. So you crawl towards us and fall in the spike pit. Mm, that wouldn't be a bad idea. Use the zombie pathing to our advantage. Let's see if it actually mm -hmm. works. Let's watch, folks. 
Oh, there's a feral walker. Oh yeah, they're actually going in. That's cool. Uh, there's one currently running just straight into a drawbridge, being a dummy. Now he went back in. Because of shot. I just have there. all the drawbridges over there down. Like, he was just running his face into the wall, I'm like... Okay, then. Like, I'm gonna head over and do what I was playing, you just stay there. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Have them all down. There we go. I said stay there, and then you follow me. Eh, whatever. We gotta have some action. There we go. I'm gonna go check the screer pit really quick, just to see... Anybody's down there. Seems a little bit light on the zombies. Well, my base is lit up like a Christmas tree. Um... Ow. It seems like the, uh, the screen pit said claimed one zombie. Sad. Only one. Only one. Just, just insert the, uh, those are rookie numbers, you gotta get those up, meme. Basically. Quickly reopen and close the drop, one of the drawbridges. You can see this is kinda like, this this base is turned into a, just a zombie, zombie, this whole area is just turned into a zombie death pit. Oh, spire zombie. Yeah. Uh, so note to self, I have to go and redo all the redo the uh, take out the bottom rungs of the ladders but that's really no big deal folks it's that's just a minor repair okay um, you know what, I'm gonna go down to the basement and just check it out you know like uh, check out the the little area like well he would show you kind of like the progress because like since this is basically self-sustaining hi spider zombie uh, oh, I was about to shoot him, and, he, uh, and then he, and then he died. Come here, guys. Come here. Definitely not me on the roof of my building. Uh, after a walker, usual loot. There we go. So yeah, let's just go see. Like you can see, like. Like I was showing how deep it goes, but um, really just kind of check to see if some of the things the staircase has uh, dried out at all. I highly doubt it. Um, uh, this part's not dry. This one's not dry. And just check to be sure. Yep. Nope. None of your stairs have dried. Fangs. Yeah, Fangs was mm -hmm. having Fangs has been having issues with. <laughs> with these stairs not drying at all. It's like he thinks they might be glitched to where they're just forever drying. But, yeah, it, it, you know, it's like, I just hope the zombies are going to get to it anytime soon. Like, the only thing that would, the only way they'd even get remotely close would be if it was, if the, uh, if they had made in, like, if the drop, one of the drop ridges was down. Zombies going over into the garage with care dogs and get out of the garage. Get out. Yep. Oh, hi, Copper. There we go. Took out the cop. And might as well just get up close and personal with these zombies. And there you go. Ah, yes. So, so if um, zombie dies on a drawbridge, then we wind up having floating corpses. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like uh, in front of the plate, like in front of where you, it's oh, actually. Oh yeah, I see it. Yeah, I was like, it's like I'm like, okay then. And I take care of that body, clean it up. Out. 
Now I'm in the spike pit again. <laughs> I, I raise it when you start walking this way, but then you decide to turn around. <laughs> oh, well. Um, what I find amazing is like the the range of the drawbridges. Like I'm able to retract them basically from over here. I can retract it from the roof. <laughs> All you need to like to seal the deal is just like a a big old you know like one of those ropes to uh, you know to let it down. Okay. Of course, you know, we got more of you. Oh, I took I took the lady's arm off. She was already crawling. Now she has no head. Fun. Because she already lost her legs. Now she's uh, now she's crawled. Now she's now she's just kind of crawled over. Just like uh, lost her arm and head. Kind of insult to injury. Bob can go away and. I really like it how this how this design has turned out. You know, like I still even have like a couple ideas to expand this a little bit. Over, like you know, kind of like link up my base to it. This is just kind of you know, like at this point we're just kind of building this out just just for the hell of it and like you know, turning it into a massive compound. Do, does it really need to be this big? No, not really. No, but that's the whole point of having infinite resources. Pretty much, we just want to build a grand scale project and. Uh, I'm gonna go check the screw pit again, just see if it's taking out any more zombies. And... Mm. Nope, nada. Damn. No more zombies. I ain't even hearing a zombie. I think they're all coming in from the west. Damn, that sucks. Yeah, it was like the past couple Horde Nights where uh, they were all coming in from the south end, and they would just go, and they would all just go and, and, uh, you know, get, you know, they would just kind of drop on the, uh, what, it, like how, they would just drop in from, you know, like, uh, drop into the screw pit before I even put the spikes in. It gets irritating, but, hey, at least, uh, you know, don't really have to worry about zombies. Mm-hmm. Charlie and his twin brother rolling on up, and that's a there that's a go. down Charlie. Yeah, so it's a pretty calm board night here, guys. Yo, it's just kind of we're at the point where we're just kind of like we're we're just we're just literally uh, just kind of like uh, just just shrugging off board night like it's not even a big deal. Because most of the time we're just sitting through it. Yep. Kind of was. It's like that's what I. That's why I like about 1.0 coming up for console version. It's like, it's like we're we're gonna be able to like the zombies will actually try and path their way around like and not be like these zombies are now. Complete idiots. I mean, you can still cheese the zombies like this with certain blocks on. On PC, this is that, uh, most of the time, like most of the other blocks, they will, they're smart enough to realize, like, hey, this ain't gonna work for you. Mm -hmm. And, oh, it, oh, I was gonna say, it looked like we had a spider zombie going, you spam me right around, you spam me right, right around. Nice. <laughs> Haven't had too much of that. Take out more. Really do get that. Off into the spike pit I go. Do, do, do. Oh, I love the things of spike pit so much. Apparently so. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, we're getting, we're kind of coming up on the end of Horde Night, though, folks. So, let's say we'll keep you over the last half hour. Apologies if it's uh, been dull, but yeah, basically, like, uh, with all things upgrades, we're basically coming up on, like, uh, 
uh, to his base, like, for, for almost out of shaving cream, ironically enough. So we basically, he's ba he, we basically gone so overkill with this so that we're uh, we're going we're going to we're we're almost out of shaving cream. That's really insane. Like, cause like we had three full chests full, but like, let me show you really quick. So just make sure I can bring that drop bridge up, and uh, so. Um, we had three of these chests full of, full of it, like. Wait a minute, you're saying we had three? Uh, we had three chests full of it, the fangs? Yeah, we did. Are you sure? Because the top was uh, full of gunpowder. Well, the top. Yeah, I, got... I moved it to the, on the bomb one to the left a bit. Mm, okay. Yeah, we had three boxes full, but that's the end of Horror Night, guys. So, I hope you enjoyed if you made this far into the episode and. Uh, Yo, hope you leave a like, comment, and subscribe down below. Have a great day, and take care.